Good morning fishermen, campers. Somebody's pulled the plug out of the lake. It's gone down two and a half, three feet. And we've had a very long dry period since, uh, since Octo October. But anyway, I'm sitting where we normally catch fish. <laughs> They're in the water. Right here, fishermen. First fish for the winter. Changed over to the fly rod. Been a few fish smelting, a few feeding fish. They were hooked up, and that's better than no hook up. Fisheries changed here. The lake's two and a half feet lower than what it should be. That's because of uh, nearly six months of virtually no rain. It changes the fishery out here. Places that used to fish, don't fish. And places that don't fish, start to fish. It's about putting in the time and the effort to go and have a nosy and fish in different spots. One might be a feeding fish by, by the looks of it. It's got a little bit of grunt in it. Hey, Pauly. Yeah, he's got a bit of, a bit of grunt. I, uh, I invested in another fly rod. He's off. Going around that bloody tree. so I can see them. I invested in another fly rod. Gibbles, uh, outdoorsman went out of business. I brought an airflow bandit, didn't cost much. So this is the first fish I've had across it. My silver fish feeder. You might have a look at him, he's swallowed the bug, he'll be getting a crack on the head. Neighbourhood cats can have this one. Oh, beautiful fish. Big hump on his head. Here we go. First one for the season this winter. Nice fish. Look at the big bump on his head there. Normally ride a weedy fish like that, but this one got a crack on the head. It's going home. About two and a half, two and three quarter pounds. A fish is better than no fish. A poorly. <laughs> 